Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First, we'll understand our question. The program has to accept the character matrix of size r cross c and the position of a cell x comma y as the input and then the program has form four string values based on the conditions. So these are the conditions. So the string s1 must be formed by traversing the cells from the given cell vertically towards top. The string s2 must be formed by traversing the cells from given cell horizontally towards right. And the string S3 must be formed by traversing the cells from the given cell vertically towards bottom. And the string S4 must be formed by traversing the cells from the given cell horizontally towards left. And finally, the program must print the longest among the four string values. And if two or more string values have the same length, print the first occurring one. So first, we'll take our test case. So in this test case, we have a sum across six matrix where the X is three and Y is also three. So now we can see that this element is specified. That is three comma three is F. Now the string S1 must be formed by the vertically towards top to this cell that is F O G. So our S1 will be F O G and then our S2 will be horizontally towards right. So it will be G K T. And then our S3 will be vertically down. So it will be like F P W H W and then our S4 is horizontally towards left. So it is F J B. And now after getting all the four strings, S3 has the maximum length. So the string S3 that is F P W H W will be our output. Now let us implement our program. First we'll get the number of rows and columns. And then we'll get the matrix equal to input of dot split of for CTR in range R and then we'll get X and Y denoting uh, element from the matrix and after getting our inputs now we'll do the further modifications that is now XY will be equal to x minus 1 and y minus 1 as we know index starts from 0 so x is x minus 1 and y is y minus 1 and now we'll have to create the uh, empty strings for this and after creating the empty strings we'll also have a uh, one more uh, empty string called as the required string that is our final output and now we have for CTR in range sorry for column in range x 1 
ठीक तो एक्स एन कमा माइनस वन कमा माइनस वन सो हेर इट इस रो सॉरी सो फॉर रो इन रेंज एक्स कमा माइनस वन कमा माइनस वन एस वन विल बी इंक्रीमेंटेड विद द मैट्रिक्स रो वाई एंड देन इफ द लेंथ ऑफ एस वन इज ग्रेटर देन लेंथ ऑफ द रिक्वायर्ड स्ट्रिंग then the required string will be equal to s1 and for column in range y comma c s2 will be incremented with the matrix of ex column and if same thing but here sort of s1 will have s2 so now the record string will be s2 and now our next loop that is for row in range x comma r the required string so before that s3 will be incremented with matrix of row and y so we'll have this condition that is if length of s3 is greater than the length of required string then the required string will be s3 and after that for column in range y comma minus 1 comma minus 1 will have the s4 incremented with the matrix of row sorry x and column and this same condition where we'll have s4 and finally we'll print the required string as our output now let us execute our program we'll pass our first test case so yes we have got the correct output now we'll pass our second test case so here also we have got the correct output our program has passed all our given test cases successfully hope you guys understand thanks for watching see you next video